Hi, it's Mike O'Connor. I'm in front of the Palmilla Complex here in Riverside uh, to show you an interior of 1311-102. Uh, this is the main driveway entrance. I'm just kind of giving you the orientation of where the unit is from here. So you can see Iowa is down there at Massachusetts Avenue. The unit in question is the lower level on the corner here and 1311 is the building. You do have a walkway along this side with um, a little bit of clearance between your um, patio which is behind here and um, the walkway. You come in through an entrance here which is not on any kind of um, remote access. It is typically locked. I've left it propped a little bit so I can get in right now. Um, one of the things I did notice about the outside of this unit is there's a little bit of water damage um, from sprinkler system presumably in this section. I'm guessing that that is maintenance for the association uh, that's here. Your level, uh, your unit is down here on the lower level and um, this is your window for your um, living room area. That's the window for the kitchen and this is how you come into the unit. So you're kind of um, greeted with a small dining area with this um, ceiling fixture and then your living room around this side. It has a couple of windows here and then an access point out to the um, patio. You do have a large storage unit that comes with this unit. Oh, I locked it. It's deep though. You can see how far down it goes on this wall. So it's a deep closet. Uh, there are two units. I believe this is the unit for this um, unit uh, as far as air conditioner. You can see you do have this enclosed patio area. The unit for upstairs, which I think is that unit, is down inside your um, gated area. You do have this uh, paver stone. Uh, you do have a water um, gutter that comes from up on the roof up there and then the small patio area. That window there is your uh, master bedroom uh, window. Coming back in, I find that it's, uh, it, I think it's all new paint. It looks like new window coverings. It also looks like new carpet. Uh, I might be mistaken on it. It is definitely not very much on wear. Unfortunately, the power is not on right now, so I'm not able to give you a lot of light to see. But over in this area is where the kitchen is. The cabinets are uh, definitely a fairly recent upgrade. I do not believe that they're brand new, but they are in very, very good condition. Uh, you do see that there's granite and there is a dishwasher. There's also a stove and a microwave and a refrigerator. And actually fairly good uh, cabinet storage space throughout in here. I apologize again without the light. Um, there are some uh, ceiling lights, can lights that are in the ceiling here in the uh, kitchen. Coming around here, this is heading in towards uh, first, there's a little uh, linen closet, decent size. I don't know how much of that you can see, unfortunately, with the, the lack of light. The master bedroom is over here. As you can see, there's another linen cabinet over here, which is uh, newer cabinetry. Uh, large closet with mirror closet doors. I noticed that the rollers need to uh, be replaced. It's a minor uh, repair that can be done and then the master with the window for the master bedroom. Uh, there is really no, um, there's very little noise that's in here with um, that window closed uh, coming from the street. You are kind of insulated in because if you can kind of see a little bit, you can see how you're wrapped around from the, the street. The street is to the left behind that fence with the walkway that was there. And perhaps you can see a little bit of the store uh, that was across the street. Coming back around, uh, your, your bathroom is right here. It is an, a remodeled bathroom. It has the same upgraded uh, newer cabinetry, uh, granite counter. Uh, there's a nice mirror, uh, medicine chest. Uh, there's also a tub, which I don't think you can see, unfortunately, and um, uh, toilet. Um, the property looks like it's in very, very good condition. Just move in. Uh, I need to have a full inspection, of course. I need to make sure that the utilities are on uh, for the inspection on Thursday.